My name's Monique. I'm going to be doing your assessment today. Can you tell me your name? Hi, Monique. My name's John. <laughs> Can you tell me where you are? Yeah, I'm in the hospital. How are you? We were stayed there. Okay. <laughs> Can you tell me the date? April 13th. Can you tell me who the president is? Oh, Bizzle. Okay. All right. I'm going to check your cranial nerves first. Okay. So cranial number one is smell. Can you tell me what this smells like? Alcohol. Got it. Cranial number number two, we did the smell and chart in your 2020. Cranial nerve number three, four, and six. So I'm going to check your blade for your foot. Can I have you raise up your eyebrows for me? Great. I'm going to check your movement of your eyes. Bring up your ears. Okay, your chin and out and go in. Right now I'm going to check your pupils. shoulder. Okay, look over my shoulder. Okay. All right, cranial number, number five and seven. So I'm going to have you puff out your cheeks for me. Can you smile, frown, scrunch up your face? Or can you bite down and tell me if you have any pain in your jaw? Okay. All right, you can feel this. Oh, yeah. All right, cranial nerve number eight. I want you to tell me if you can feel this radiate down both sides of your body. I sure can. Okay. And tell me when you can't hear this anymore. Okay, I can't hear it. Can you hear that? Yep. Okay. Okay, you can't hear it anymore. Okay, I can't. Can you hear that? Oh, yeah. Tell me if you can feel this vibrate right up your leg. I really can. Can you? Jeez. Are you good? Yep. Okay. Good deal. Cranial number number nine, ten, and twelve. So I'm going to uh, you stick out your tongue. Go up to your nose, down, poke out your cheeks. Good. I'm gonna have you open up your mouth and you're gonna look inside. Say ah. Uh, ah. Uh, yeah. Right. Okay. Have you drink this water for me? Alrighty. Alright, and now cranial nerve number 11. You're gonna shrug your shoulders. Push your head with my hand, other side. Good. Okay, I'm gonna have you do rapid hand movements like this. Put your finger to your thumb. Okay, I'm going to have you touch your nose and come out to my finger. Good. All right, and now you put both of your palms up and then close your eyes. I'm going to put this in there. Can you tell me what that is? It's a paper clip. Good job. Can you tell me what I am writing? A number eight. Good job. All right, now I'm going to have you keep your eyes closed and tell me if this is sharp or dull. Sharp? Sharp? Dull, I mean. Sharp. Dull. Sharp. Dull. Okay, good. Alright, now I'm gonna have you stand up. Close your eyes and keep your hands just down on your side. Good, now put your arms up. Lift one leg up. Okay, other leg. Okay, go ahead and open your eyes. I'm going to have you put your heel to your shin and go down on both sides. Good job. I'm going to have you walk across the room, heel, I mean your heel to your toes. All right. Come back and go on your heels only. And then one more time, walk on your tippy toes. All right, and then go ahead and come back over. Put your hands together and bend over. I'm going to check your spine for scoliosis. Any pain in your vertebrae? No pain. All right, go ahead and come back up. I'm going to have you sit back down. Okay. Now that we've done all your cranial nerves, we're going to just do a basic assessment. We're going to look at your skin, make sure there's nothing going on, check your hair, your scalp, any pain or anything? No pain, no issues. Any pain in your ears? No. Nope. Okay, we're going to look inside.
find them real quick. And check here. We have the membranes. And we'll get you a control. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I'll change it because you don't want the same one in your nose. <laughs> your mouth earlier so we need that. I'm just going to fill your gland and your lymph nodes since you're not swollen enough at all. Okay and then I'm going to check and have you put your head and check your BBD. And I'm going to check your carotid against your radial. I'm feeling I'm going to have the swell again. I'm going to check your thyroid. Mm. And I'm going to listen to your carotid. Just to put that down. Hold your breath for me. And hold your breath again. Okay, thank you. Okay, now I'm going to have you turn to the side a little bit. Check your lungs. Have you just take deep breaths for me the first time? Tricuspid and your mitral. Alright, I'm going to have you lay on your left side and I'm going to listen to them again. Come back so I can listen to your heart. Oh, yeah, for some reason I was thinking. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Aortic, pulmonic, herbs, tricuspid. Alright, now go ahead and lay flat on your back. I'm going to inspect your stomach. No distension or anything. I'm going to listen to it for bowel sounds. I'm going to percuss. And I'm going to do a light palpitation. Just let me know if there's any pain anywhere. No pain? No pain. And I'm going to do a deeper palpitation then. Take a deep 
breath and I'm going to feel for your liver. And I'm going to check over here for your spleen. So you have a deep breath. Feel for your aorta. And then I'm going to listen to it too. Just to make sure. Good. Okay. And while I'm here, I'm going to check your pulses. Have a lap scan. And I love you. Squeeze my fingers. There you go. Okay, now come up against my arm. Oops. Now go down, go out, and go in. I'm going to check your patellar pulse. And go over here. Thank you. And then I'm going to make sure you don't have any edema going on. I would check your cap ratio on your toes and again your fingers. And then you're I'm gonna have you sit up for me on the ledge. And have you push up against my hands and now pull back. I'm gonna check for a home in this ear. Any pain in your No uh, pain. Okay. Any pain? No pain. Okay. I'm gonna do a quick reflex check. Yes. 